Hi, it's Brent Abel here at Web Tennis, and I want to do a quick little look see here at John Isner's tossing motion. And, you know, the thing that we want to work on is making sure that the toss is not in the fingertips, where you kind of flick the fingertips. It's not in your wrist, where again, you kind of flick the wrist to get the ball up. And it's also not in your elbow, where you're sort of bending your elbow. And the reason for that is your toss is inconsistent, but you don't get into the proper hitting position uh, when you toss that way, as opposed to lifting the ball from the front shoulder. So what we're going to look at here is, I'm just going to kind of drag this through here, and we're going to look at how the arm stays straight, going all the way up, a little blurry, sorry about that. But what happens is you can really get a sense that, you know, when he starts, when he starts here um, with the arm already straight, I start more with the bent elbow, but this is fine. You know, and just make sure that you feel the ball is coming up. The ball is being lifted from here, not in your elbow, not in your wrist, not in your fingertips. And that you'll be more consistent with the placement, number one. But number two, this tossing motion where you finish with the arm up and straight, it really puts you into the right hitting position for the swing to be able to give you you know, racket speed for power and for and for spin. So you can practice this. Practice again. Straight arm tossing motion coming out of the shoulder. And there you have it.